ballin', spawn a pretty dollar, man, my kicks awesome. Hundred dollar lip gloss, and now she got my dick. Hey, man. It's Presho Live. Y'all tuned in. Listen, Diamond.com, Presho.com. Yo, how was the, the showcase you did last week? Uh, the showcase was like, it was okay. It was okay, you know what I'm saying? But it was like a it was like a bad location. Okay. Yeah, that's all, the only thing that we regret about it. It was a bad location. A lot of people, a lot of our fans told us that we got lost. It was pull, It was like in a little kind of Fuji area. Like, people got pulled over in the parking lot. It was mm. just, yeah. Like, what was this at? This was like out on 51. Oh, Shannon. Like Castle, Castle Shannon. Castle Shannon. Yeah. I know that place. It's uh, Library Road. Uh, yeah. yeah. The Library Palace, Road. something like yeah, that. Yeah, Royal Palace. Palace or something. Yeah, Royal Palace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They used to do like a lot of boxing and stuff out there. I never really seen nobody like yeah. perform. Yeah, we had a lot of our supporters out there. Though. It was a cool little thing. Yeah, definitely, yeah. man. I, I've been noticing like the Mon Valley area, period. Yeah. Like a lot of y'all cast is putting out some good music. Right. Like a lot. Like it's a lot of. It's not even the same music, you know what I'm saying? Everyone got their own lane. Mm -hmm. It's like a lot of y'all parts of music. Like, what's the, what's that feeling out there in Mont Valley, man? Uh, like Mont Valley, like, that's where they get like the whole stiller and the whole like. If you can't be a Pittsburgh, if you don't like acknowledge the Mont Valley area, because like that's where the steel, that's where the steel mills, everything is at. Like, I don't care what you say, you could be from there in the middle of the city, you can't. <laughs> if you don't acknowledge the Mont Valley, then you ain't a real Pittsburgh. I mean, that's what the Steelers is built on. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. The whole, the whole mentality of yeah. ground hard. And, and it's like a real blue collar area. A lot of hard workers. You know what I'm saying? A lot of hard workers out there. You know? Yeah, because I had talked to, I talked to B White. He had named, he yeah. named, he had a short list of names of people. You know what I'm saying? Definitely to look out for. You yeah, know what I'm saying? He was part of that short list. That's a real good friend of mine, B White. You know? Yeah, that's a real good friend of mine. Like, what's the what's the inspiration behind your music? You know what I'm saying? To to force it out there like you do, because you've been, like I said, you've been dropping videos, getting major views yeah, you know what i'm sure. saying like what's the what's the inspiration behind grimy's music and shig's music um, i think like we give you the real deal where we come from no fiction the, sh the struggle like like i mean poverty all the all the type of shit that's going right. on out there all the shit we've been through and all the shit we're doing now for real for real, like you listen to my raps or raps and shit like we say some shit like niggas don't, we say shit niggas would never say in they raps and shit like, and, and we really did that shit and laid that shit, you know what I'm saying? So niggas will hear that shit and really relate to us more because they understand where we're coming from or, or see us out or be like, damn, I know them niggas, they really do that shit. Like, right. You know and we put a lot of content in our music too. That's what, that's what my inspiration is like, I listen to real music. I listen to like all the club and stuff, all that, all that stuff, like the little snap, all that, everything is cool. Until like you know when you wake up and then you sober and up and then now you want to hear some real stuff. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. You want to hear something that you know is real. Something got a little substance right. behind it. Right, a little substance. That's what I, I put a lot of substance in my rap. What my inspiration though is like, uh, just how you said that right there. Just being overlooked. That 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 make me inspired. That make me work extra hard. Mm -hmm. So I got like, you know what I'm saying. I got to work harder than the average person who got to work. All right, definitely, man. Like yeah, like we said, you know what I'm saying. Martin Valley got a lot of different artists out there. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play a track that was on B White's uh, album, The Anomaly. You know what I'm saying? It basically it showcases everybody that was. You know what I'm saying? And Martin Valley. You know what I'm saying? There's a couple people not on it, but it still it still puts on for the city. You know what I'm saying? For that area that's going on out there. So the joint's called Martin Valley. You know what I'm saying? The man Grimey is on this joint with B White. Uh, who else is on? Four Mayo. Pound, four maybe. pound. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a nice roster on this joint. So y'all check it out. Don't go nowhere as the press show. We ain't here chilling with Grimey. Grimey.